is where are the carbs? Like if you're really trying to be a low carb person, what would you have to cut out? And so this is a picture that I like of my, my pyramid or my plate. And it's got some foods, and so I love everybody listening in and looking in to, to just look at that and think, you know, of all the different food groups we have, where are the carbs? How about, Sarah, one more slide, the grains? Are they in the, are, are the vegetables? Are they, yep, veggies are mostly carbs. Okay, but we want people to eat veggies. Veggies are full of fiber and they're full of nutrients. I mean, even the ketogenic group wants you to eat veggies. So don't leave out the veggies. Make sure you eat those. How about fruits? Next slide. Uh, yeah, fruits, that's mostly carbs. Okay. And then we got that dairy group. Any carbs? Oh, yeah, right. Lactose, lots of carbs in the dairy. Okay. And the grains. Yep. Grains are mostly carbs. And then in that protein group, other than the meat, beans and peas are in that group. So the whole damn thing is foods full of carbs. If you're going to eat low carb, what the heck are you going to eat if you start cutting them all out? They're everywhere except meat, which would be a pretty boring diet. Meat and refined fats. And so just to appreciate, you know, I, I don't like talking about nutrients as much as foods. All the food groups right there are major sources of carbs. So if you're going to cut back on carbs severely and restrict them, you're not going to have a lot left to eat. So I'm always scratching my head about how low in carbs people are thinking about. So let's move 